Once upon a time, in a small English village, lived a curious and imaginative young girl named Alice. Alice had a wild mane of golden hair and eyes that sparkled with mischief. She possessed an insatiable appetite for adventure and a mind full of wonder. One sunny afternoon, while chasing a white rabbit, Alice stumbled upon a rabbit hole hidden beneath a moss-covered oak tree. Without a second thought, she followed the rabbit down the seemingly endless tunnel. As Alice descended, the world around her transformed into a kaleidoscope of colors and shapes. When Alice finally landed, she found herself in a peculiar place called Wonderland. The sight before her was unlike anything she had ever seen. A topsy-turvy world where the rules of reality seemed to bend and twist. A talking doorknob greeted Alice and directed her to a nearby garden where the Queen of Hearts held court. In the garden, Alice encountered an array of eccentric characters. There was the Mad Hatter, a perpetually tea-obsessed fellow with a large top hat, and the March Hare, who seemed to be stuck in an eternal tea party. The Cheshire Cat, known for its mischievous grin, appeared and disappeared at will, guiding Alice through her bewildering journey. As Alice navigated through Wonderland, she faced numerous challenges and puzzling situations. She grew and shrunk in size, drank potions, and nibbled on cakes to alter her dimensions. She played croquet with flamingos as mallets and hedgehogs as balls under the watchful eye of the Queen of Hearts, who was notorious for her quick temper and love of beheading. Amidst the chaos, Alice's determination never wavered. She sought wisdom from the enigmatic caterpillar, and received cryptic advice about finding her true self. She encountered the whimsical Tweedledee and Tweedledum, who regaled her with tales of Jabberwocky and the mystical White Queen. Throughout her adventures, Alice yearned to return to the familiarity of her own world. She longed for the simple pleasures of home and the comforting presence of her family. Yet she also cherished the enchantment and extraordinary experiences that Wonderland offered. In her final encounter, Alice stood before the Red Queen, who challenged her to a game of chess. With her wit and resourcefulness, Alice navigated the treacherous board, making strategic moves and outsmarting her opponent. As she reached the opposite end, Alice transformed into a queen herself, finally realizing her potential and embracing her inner strength. Just as Alice was crowned, she found herself back near the oak tree where her adventure began. She climbed out of the rabbit hole, her heart filled with bittersweet memories of the extraordinary world she had left behind. Alice returned to her village, forever changed by her encounter with Wonderland. She carried with her a newfound curiosity, a belief in the impossible, and an unquenchable thirst for adventure. As she grew older, Alice shared her tales of wonder with wide-eyed children, inspiring them to embrace their own imaginations and explore the magical possibilities that lie beyond the ordinary. And so, the legend of Alice in Wonderland lived on, a timeless tale of curiosity, courage, and the limitless power of the human imagination. Thanks for watching.